It's fall time at Ride Divide and the weather has finally cooled down enough to get to work. At my trails, we only have five wooden features. Everything else is dirt. Dirt is easy to work with and there's endless amounts of it. But wooden features make a trail funner and more exciting. Only one out of the five wooden features are actually beginner friendly. So today, we're gonna shrink this pile of wood and add to our bike park. Because in this video, we're gonna build an A-frame. And for this A-frame, we need some space. So to create some, I used the rake and cleared out the perfect trail for this feature. This project will definitely be pushing the limits of how close we can get to the golf course. On the map, you can see that the trail connects bad ball and driver. We have a problem. I don't know where to connect the trails. As you can see, there's a berm right there and there's a tree right there. So I'm just thinking, what if I just make a jump right before the berm and over the log so that you do the jump and you go into the rest of the trail. Let's see if that works. The winter rain hasn't arrived at my trails yet, so for now, this jump is gonna be really dusty and not work the best, but as soon as the rain comes, this little jump is gonna become perfectly packed and really good. So let's get to measuring the wood for this airframe. Wait, that's actually a good name. <laughs> As I was almost done cutting the wood, it was almost evening, and I only have one day to finish. You see, my dad works long hours, so he's gone most of the weekdays and comes home late. That means I only have access to the tools during the weekends. And today is Sunday, so I only have two hours to finish. That is so stable. Alright guys, so now we got the tree out of the way, and yeah, let's see if I can stand on it. Oh my goodness, this is so scary for some reason. Okay, so I did check, and sadly, no, the chain ring does not clear the top, so you'll get high centered on it.
the sun was on its way to set, I had the whole trail complete. Now to test it. All right, so I just looked at this thing and I realized that you can not only just ride up onto it and ride down that, you can actually come with more speed, go more this way, jump off the side, right where those printing stuff is, jump over these bushes and land into that berm. Sketchy line, but I'm gonna try it. Oh! Alrighty, this thing works, and there's actually a couple ways you can ride this thing, but I actually messed this up. I got carried away and built this thing way too crazy. In fact, it took me about 10 run-ups to actually commit to sending it. So one day I'm gonna have to change that. I hope you enjoyed, and if you did, please subscribe. It's free, and it helps the channel a lot, and I'll see you guys next time. Ugh, I wish I got paid for doing this.